welcome, my child. Please, help. <laughs> he always tried to be so strong for us. When the fog came, we thought it was just unusual weather. But then we started hearing these noises, horrible screeching. It wasn't that weather. It was something else. With every passing minute, the screeching got louder, like they were multiplying. We knew we couldn't stay. We had to leave. When Samuel opened the door, it happened so quickly. Like a dream, a horrible nightmare. One of those creatures jumped out of the fog and into the house. It lunged right past Samuel for Jenny. She barely had enough time to scream. It all happened so quickly. We both ran into the closet. It was just our natural reaction. It couldn't have been more than a few seconds before more of them came. The room was practically filled with them. I froze. Samuel covered my eyes and watched as our daughter was eaten alive by those monsters. When I close my eyes, all I can hear are her screams. They finally left when there was nothing left of her. The blood. There was so much blood. We were supposed to protect her. We left and made our way to St. Patrick's. When everything seemed to calm down. When we realized this wasn't just a bad dream. It was just too much for Samuel. He couldn't bear to sit and wait for help. He wanted revenge. He didn't care about living anymore. The guilt was eating him alive. Have you ever experienced anything so horrible? Having to watch something so precious being violated. I pray it is something you will never have to witness. Samuel left hours ago. He doesn't stand a chance out there. Please, find him and bring him back to me. Or get him to safety. Please. Cadet, it looks like Samuel may be on a ledge attempting to jump in the center of the city. Be cautious. This will require a delicate approach. Don't you come any closer! I'll jump! I swear I'll do it! It's just better off this way. So... She must have told you about Jenny, then. How am I supposed to go on after that? I can't avenge her, I tried! Those things are so vicious! And I'm only human. I've just got my bare hands. I'm no match for them.
and my daughter. We'll avenge her. Okay. Okay, fine. But you make sure you kill every last one of them. Make them pay for what they did to my Jenny. Okay. of the others. They're saying that if you're taken by those monsters, you roam the streets in death like a zombie. Oh my god. If that's true, it means Jenny. Oh my god. I can't bring myself to even think about it. If she is out there, she must be in so much pain. Please. I know you've already done so much. Please, can you find her? If she's out there, please find her and let her rest. I can't go on knowing she's out there with those monsters. Sadly, no. Oh my god. This feels like a nightmare. I just want to wake up. Jenny. She loved life, her family, and her friends. She loved meeting up with them to play sports outside. I can't believe this is happening.
Incoming call from Major Frost. Patching her in now. Cadet, we've pinpointed certain locations in the city that seem to be nested strongholds for these creatures. We're working on sending over the coordinates. Check your map for orange hazard symbols pinpointing the identified strongholds. It may take a few minutes for them to show up on your map. I need you to make your way into the strongholds and clear them out. Those creatures are building up in numbers down there, most likely mounting an army for an assault. This is urgent, Cadet. Make your way into the Stronghold and get it cleared out ASAP. Cadet, you've got another incoming call from... Hmm. Oh, Private Howard. I'll patch him in now. Hey there, girlie. How's it going out there? I sure do hope you're not getting yourself in too much trouble. Listen, wanted to let you know that we're all cheering for you. That's right. Me, Meeks, Orensky, Fang, and everyone else. <laughs> We're all cheering for you, and we know you can do this. You got this, girly. Good luck out there. Oh, don't forget to come back in for your training. It'll give us a chance to see that pretty little face of yours. <laughs> well, that's it for now. See you around. <laughs> 